but they don't have the understanding they don't have the perception ya ahl al kitab lima takfuruna bi ayat al alaw see the appeal the style of appeal appealing to any good sense in them ya ahl al kitab lima takfuruna bi ayat al alaw antum tashhadun oh people of the book why are you be lying why are you denying the ayat of allah wa antum tashhadun and you are yourself in your hearts you are a witness to it that this is correct from your heart you have recognized quran and muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam even wantum tashhadun you are yourself testifying your hearts are testifying to the truth of quran and even then you are belying it you are denying it ya ahl alkitab lima takfuruna bi ayatillah wantum tashhadun ya ahl alkitab lima talbisuna alhaqq bil batil the same verse which appeared in the fifth section of surah al-baqarah ولا تلبس الحق بالباطل وتكتم الحق وانتم تعلمون يا اهل الكتاب لم تلبسون الحق بالباطل او بيبل اوف دي بوك واي ار يو كفرنج دي تروث وذ فالس هود وتكتمون الحق اند يو ار كونسيلينج اند هايدنج دي تروث وانتم تعلمون ان يو ار دوينج ات نوينغلي يو نو ذات يو ار دوينج سمثينج رونغ يو نو ذات ذس از حق اند وات يو ار ترينج اند تو كفر يو نو وذ ذات از باطل بت يو ار دوينج ات وقال طائفه من اهل الكتاب and so conspired a group of the people of the book a few jews you know in madina they con- they were a conspiracy because they saw that the muslim you know they are so strict and they are so steadfast in their religion that whosoever embraces islam whatever might happen to him he never goes back he is ready to lay down his life he is ready to sacrifice every all his belongings he never goes back from islam so to break you know this the the moral courage that had the support that the muslims were getting from this fact they made a conspiracy what was the conspiracy declared in the morning to be muslims you one day remain a muslim in the evening you declare kufr and you go back to your your um, former religion so that this sark you know this good will of islam this good will of iman that can be broken people will think some of some of the people will be forced to think what happened these were very gentle people they came they accepted islam they appeared to be very sincere they remained with the prophet whole the day there must be something wrong they must have seen something but due to which they have gone back so this can bring about they raise doubts among the minds of weak muslims all they were muslims of all grades they are muslims who are very strong in their faith and they were muslims also who had just recently converted to islam so they could bring you know doubts they could produce doubts in the minds of such weak muslims so that was the conspiracy now read the ayah what that waqala taifatu min ahli al kitab and so said a group of the people from the book people of the book amanu bil ladhi unzila ala al ladhina amanu wajha an nahar you declare to be mumin about those things about that which has been sent down to these uh, believers that is you declare that we believe in quran that this is the word of allah aminu bil ladhi unzila ala alladhina amanu whatsoever has been sent on these believers you also declare that you believe in it wajhan nahar at the break of the day wa kfuru akhirahu and in the evening you deny it you return to your own religions your formal religion la'allahum yarji'un so in this way we can hope that some of them also will will come back will come out and doubts will appear in their minds wala tu'minu illa liman tabi'a deenakum deenakum but never believe except on that person who follows your deen this will be only to show off this will only be a drama you are not going to believe wala tu'minu illa liman tabi'a deenakum except that person who follows your deen 
in al huda hud Allah. Now this is a comment from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and the guidance is the guidance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. An yuta ahadun misla ma uti tum or you have you kum behi in the rabbikum lest someone else may be granted the like of what they, you have been granted, granted to you or they would prevail over you in the argument before your Lord. Don't tell them what what signs of Prophet Muhammad sallallahu are there in, in Torah so that they cannot argue with you on the day of judgment before Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. You have to follow your own deen but you know to bring and produce doubts in the minds of some Muslims we shall declare to be Muslims for some time, temporarily. Tell them, O Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, that all bounty is in the hands of Allah. He gives it, he grants it to whomsoever he likes. Wallahu wasi'un alim, and Allah is all embracing, all knowing. Yaqtasso bi rahmatihi man yasha. He singles out for his mercy, whomsoever he likes. Wallahu zul fadlil azim, and Allah has great bounty. 